All right, and we're back. <clears throat> Oops. Um. Okay. Um. So we're good. All right. So let's see. What do we actually have in terms of uh, skills and whatnot? Let's see. I think they. I think everybody has everything. I think. At this point, yeah. <clears throat> Flare Mega Bomb. And we tried. We used Dark Eternal. <laughs> And we used a Dark Eternal. Uh, so let's go ahead and switch over uh, some of these characters to other ones. No, oh, I want to go to Y. I think it's this one. Yeah. Alright, um, who next? <clears throat> and for one, um, these guys are at, you know, 67 and 8. That's pretty close to where these ones are. I don't think we need to level them up any more than we have. And we could, I suppose. Um, whoops. But I think they're high enough level, well, I think they're high enough level now. We just need to make sure we have the parties set up correctly, uh, when we go back in. Because, um, some of them don't work very well in this area, because you have to be able to kill stuff off or, um, uh, prevent it from doing things. Um, for example, uh, whoever has Magus, that party will be, uh, pretty strong, because I'm just gonna keep that thing with them, so... Um, Marl, basically Marl and Megas shouldn't be on the same party, because Megas will just kill the stuff off, Marl's used to cast stop on it, so, um, whoever we put in, uh, whichever party she goes into, um, shouldn't be the same as, my, as the one Megas is on, otherwise it's kind of a waste of resources. Alright, um... Specific uh, rock triple triple fight with these combinations, guys. So that's fine. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and. Uh, I mean, it doesn't even matter even if we put something on him. Uh, I'd rather do the speed. Yeah. Because I mean, he's gonna do that ma that damage no matter what, so. Kind of a waste to put anything else on him. Um, okay, magic scarf. So that increases magic power, but do we want to keep that? Or do we want to switch over to like maybe the power ring or something? Um, counter attack rate 50%. To be honest, this might actually be <clears throat> better on him. We'll see. Maybe him or maybe Robo. I'm not sure which one yet. Uh, they both have pretty high attack. Actually, Glenn's attack's higher. But, <clears throat> that said... Um, Robo's power is maxed out. Glenn's isn't. So whenever ever we get a new weapon for Robo, his power level will be much higher. So, power seal, which is what he has on. So, this, this power stat's maxed out no matter what. Um, magic ring, wall ring. Do I have something better for speed than that? Speed belt. Nine to seven. seven. Alright. Um. Yeah. Okay. Because this speed is really low. Right, let's go ahead and save that. Configuration. Let's head back in. Um. Really quickly. What text do we still need? Nirvana X. Oh, that's right. Your memory. He's almost. Uh, Glenn almost has that. He'll get it pretty quickly. Green memory, though, I think. Oh, same thing. Okay, good. <laughs> I'll be done quicker than I thought. 
these two. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, um, basically the goal is just to get all the last techs on everybody, and then to, while doing that, level people up a bit more. Um, I think we're pretty much, like, on the cusp of being able to take this place out. Uh, it's just that the enemies are so ridiculous that you kind of have to go, um, over level a bit more. Even even at the state I'm in now, these guys can still take me out, take me out pretty easily. It's it's about the statuses, you know, uh, with the uh, ruminators. I've been done by now. Guess not. Oh, he is healing now, so I suppose. There we go, finally. <laughs> Robo level up. Um, <clears throat> so, Frog has. Glenn has, um. Cure 2 tech as well, so we can use that to heal people with. Oh, wow. He has no MP. Very good. And Magus is kind of low too. That's another thing that makes this game kind of hard in general. Chrono Trigger game, games, base games hard. Is that you can only have a maximum of 999 health and 99 MP. Has less health than the uh, they have less health than the middle mutes, so all right, both of those texts should be learned. Yep, and we honestly like, could just go right back out now and grab somebody else, but for the moment, let's just, uh, use those skills. <coughs> well, I've used Nirvana X before. I think, uh, Green Memory is a healing skill. Actually, I don't want to do that. Let's it. Okay, so Green Memory. Yeah, auto revise an ally, so... You can cast this in over a certain amount of time, and an ally, if they get killed, will be revived automatically. And the run out to something. Before we got owned. 
does like 3,000 damage. So that's another thing. <clears throat> Nirvana X. It may take a bunch of MP. I think it takes like 10 or 20 MP or something. But it, it works just like Mega says double tap on these guys. It's not as powerful, obviously, but it does kill them in one hit. Uh, 20, yeah. So that's like uh, friggin' full either every turn almost, but every battle almost, but yeah. So he can go in with Marl on Marl's team because we won't need him on Magus' team either. So we're kind of getting a, a shape of what these teams are going to look like. So they're going to have Magus on one team, Marl and Frog on another. They'll probably have Isla and Chrono on one and Robo on the other as well, maybe. Um, we'll need to see. Well, and Chrono are the only ones left. I know Chrono's got uh, the full... As all this goes, I'm not sure about Isla. Yeah, Isla has a multi. Okay, I can see where we go. <clears throat> Alright, so... Well, let's see how this party works. So her stamina, magic, defense, and power are all maxed out. Let's go ahead and give her a speed belt. Get her speed maxed out as well. I guess we'll use the shelter and save. Alright. <clears throat> this time it's for real. <laughs> bother with those guys. Or most of these, we don't have to. It's a waste of resources. Oh, nice. We have to go around it. You can get around stuff that works pretty well. Alright. I definitely want to have both of them in the same party so they can use double cure. Um, but Lucka or Robo? That's the question. And Robo's pretty strong, but... But... Um, the question is... What are his dual techs with these two? Or should we bring in Lucka? Because she'll have the better dual techs with Marl, <clears throat> and maybe even a triple tech with the, with all of them. I'm not sure who has any triple techs with these guys. Um, let's go ahead and bring her in. Just because I want to keep them both together. She can do chaos, and she can cause stop. So that helps to um, limit range of movement of enemies a bit. Um, everybody has max health and MP now, so it's not like that's a, a deciding factor. Um... Robo does a lot of damage, true, but damage doesn't win you these, these battles, you have to think more strategically. Uh, 
Um, so who should go across this side? I think this group should go on this one, so it should be the other guys. Go ahead and go through with these this party first. <clears throat> already. 500 damage, it's pretty heavy to deal with. Especially when you can run into another group of those guys. So there's a couple other chests around here, or at least they're on the other side. I'm not sure. We didn't get very far on this. Only a fool could fix this bridge. Alright, we need to, um, This is the, the group that I got owned by last time. Actually, my bolt bite might not do much against these guys. They're pretty resistant to magic. But this is kind of physical, though, too. No, yeah. I didn't see any damage. I wonder if it's an instant kill now. Probably takes a lot of MP though. I should have bought some more stuff while I was out side of the place. So well, we'll make do. What the hell? Oh. Um, yeah. Okay. Well, it's an instant kill just because it does so much damage. It's like Nirvana Slash. Or Nirvana X, so in that way. <clears throat> I wonder if Megas is just immune to status effects. I've never seen him get affected by any negative statuses so far. At least not since we started using him in this dungeon. Well, it could be... Let's see. Yeah, 
I, I think it's a weapon. That's interesting. I wonder what this is about. Let's defeat this crawly. Or hexapod or whatever it is. These guys are going to be annoying us with the other team. I think, I'm not sh so only a... Uh, there's a question though, does going down this prevent us from fixing the bridge? Oh, we can't go down it anyway. I thought we could go down it. Never mind. Hey, we're standing over like you could go down it. But I guess you can't. Yeah, I'll have to fight these guys again. So we definitely need to go up to that second second uh, area there. Take this guy out. Make us a little bit. All right, so <clears throat> we have to wait up here for the other team to step on this. We might have to actually step on that for something for them. Let's see if anybody has that um, weapon. Oh, it is for uh, it's for Glenn, but it's weak. I'm pretty sure that impacts is it's either Lucka or it's Robo. Pretty sure it's Robo. Characters, that's fine. Um, <clears throat> so, definitely need to heal. Um, so, let's go to tech. I think we can't use uh, double tech so, uh, battles, so that's fine. Alright, let's go ahead and fight him and see how this goes. Nice. Oh wow, tons of damage too. 
I wonder if it's not elemental then. Lime bomb. Fly frog player, nice. <clears throat> Two new double techs. Oh wow, what the hell? Mara, what are you doing? What the Wow. The characters are kinda screwed up, aren't they? What in the hell happened to that? <laughs> I've never seen that happen before where the characters go all over the place like that. Actually, I might have seen it once before. Not on this uh, walkthrough, but before when I was playing once I did. Hmm. Ah. Yeah, so there's another, and this is like the first time you ever, ever think of the possibility of Wildest actually being part of a race. <clears throat> of individuals. And not <clears throat> not Lavas being just like a cosmic entity, but actually being a more advanced race. I wonder if the music right there is, um, like a mistake or something. Okay, so here's that switch for that. So like, just changes randomly there, and there it changed again. That's right, the, the chest will move around. That's definitely for Lucka. Oh, wow. That is insane. That's like almost a hundred more attack power. Damage can vary. Um, let's try it out. Of course, she gets stopped. That didn't affect her. Good. No! Alright, so let's go ahead and. Don't have enough MP. <laughs> to use it. Yeah, there only has eight. Wow. Okay, that would explain it. For sure. So damage varies based on something. I'm not sure what. See if it um if it changes. <laughs> Interesting, so this is a stable amount of damage. Except for Magus, but he has to use double tap. But still, if it was straight, straight physical attack, she does way more damage. Now, it's like the complete opposite of what. 